Hi everyone, it's Lulu and I am here in all of my Afro glory to show you how I multiply my flexi rods whenever I run out and this is also a collaboration. So let's meet the other YouTubers. Oh, aren't you glad to meet me? I think you should, I'd be glad to meet me. If I were you, aren't you glad to meet me? I think you should. I make a real good song. Out of you, time is ticking slow. Yes, you're overdue. Aren't you glad to meet me? I think you should. I mean, I really think you should. Yeah. Oh, God, I love you. Oh, God, I love you. I'm starting with some flexi rods, 36 of them. Apogee style and wrap mousse, my favorite. And Entwine creme jelly styler, this is like my favorite brand ever. I'm going to start by applying the creme jelly styler throughout my hair just a little bit on each of the four sections of my hair so that way it's easier to part, easier to manipulate as I curl my hair. And I've already done the back so I'm going to turn around so I can show you how I do it in the front so that way you can see better. I went ahead and parted my hair in large rectangular sections. This one is one inch deep and about four and a half, five inches long. and. I also grabbed my creme jelly styler again and really, really massaged it through my scalp all over my hair so that way the section was thoroughly saturated. And I grabbed one small section out of the large section and just clipped the rest of the hair back, added some mousse to the hair, really massaged it through. That's a very important thing to do. And just applied a little bit more creme jelly styler so that way the hair could feel almost like I had a little bit of gel in it and just combed it through before wrapping it with the flexi rod. Now you want to make sure whenever you're flexi rodding your hair that you have some extra flexi rod on the end out of the way just for security and I wrapped my hair around the flexi rod just wrapping and smoothing and wrapping and smoothing and wrapping and smoothing all the way to the end. And to secure my ends so they're not too fuzzy or frizzy, I just grabbed some Shine and Jam and it sucks as an edge control, I've said it before, but I love it to secure my ends. So I just apply it and smooth around and my ends are like perfectly smooth. So now I'm just gonna add more hair to the same flexi rod, get it out of the way and grab another section of hair. About the same size as the first one, one by one inch and repeat the process. Add some mousse to the section of hair and then follow up with a little bit of creme jelly styler if it is needed. If the hair feels perfectly fine, don't worry about it, skip this step. And just work the product through the hair to prevent reversion and to also just make it so it's like perfectly smooth as you wrap it around the flexi rod and just comb it out before wrapping around. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap my hair around the flexi rod and overlapping over the previous section of hair is perfectly fine. It's not gonna affect the curls in any way. It actually might even secure the ends better, I don't know. But just wrap around and smooth and wrap around and smooth and wrap around and smooth all the way down to the end. The brand of these flexi rods is Annie. I love this brand because I've tried a lot of brands and they're all garbage, but this is like the best brand ever for my beauty supply store. So again, the Shine and Jam for the ends and just apply a little bit and just wrap around to smooth the hair. So that way it's perfectly smooth from roots to ends. And so yeah, repeat the process. And that's all there is to it. That's pretty much how I multiply my hair onto flexi rods. If I don't have enough flexi rods, not everybody can afford 72 flexi rods or 100 flexi rods or however many flexi rods people use on their hair. I don't know. But that's what I do. And it does result in shorter curls, like tighter curls, but it's so pretty and your curls will drop at some point and be elongated and pretty. So you will actually keep your curls longer. And the products that I used really work together to make your curls last. 
so I think I'm in love with this product combination and I will be exploring product combinations more in the future but right now I think I'm working on the fourth one I lost count but on average for most of them I put four on and then go ahead and secure the flexi rod and that's all there is to it so the next morning these are my flexi rods I only used 16 in my head and these are the rest of them of the 36 so I was really happy about that and I just went ahead and removed the flexi rods like a regular flexi rod or a regular roller that's all you have to do just remove it like a regular roller make sure your hair is dry though and that's it see four in one I have these really smooth curls and I love it and this is so perfect for me because instead of taking out four rollers I'm only taking one out and it just cuts out time when you're removing your rollers if you have to go you're a mom you're working you have an event you have something going on it's like it's so much faster I love it and it's idiot proof it really is idiot proof because this is like the third time I've done this so I am really 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 happy and obviously you can see because I'm making you watch all of this all of this <laughs> sorry but I also was able to in the back put six of them on one section so that was pretty cool because my hair in the back is really really difficult to deal with but I was able to put six on one flexi rod so yeah that was really cool to me I sprayed my hair with some Chi spray and I just want to finish it and get rid of it because I've had it for like two years I don't even think it works anymore but yeah just smooth your hair out and separate the curls if you want to separate them I am loving this short cropped look I'm loving short hair lately you guys I want to do a lot of stuff with short hair like in the summer but yeah I'm loving the short almost tapered look it's like a short curly afro and it just it just looks really cute you guys saw it on Instagram so yeah these are my curls and that's pretty much it for this video please do not forget to check out the other ladies videos in this collaboration and I will have them all linked down below also if you haven't subscribed already subscribe if you like this video give me a big thumbs up and comment down below and give me suggestions as well and I will talk to you in the next one thank you so much for watching as always 